This is like the only spot for good lighting. I know, and then one light bulb is <laughs> out, but it's out. just wanted to update you. We made it. That's what we the whole road it. trip we was for it. to begin with. This is my apartment in maybe, Georgia. Maybe we should do an apartment tour later. Yeah, I mean, it's like not too messy right now, but yes. <laughs> well, we'll see ya tomorrow. Hello guys. So me and Samantha, let me stay over here actually. Me and Samantha decided yesterday that we wanted to go to the aquarium in Georgia. It is the biggest aquarium in the US. So let's go see her. Hello. Oh, oh, the the lighting is so bad. <laughs> Hello. I actually heard from somebody that it's the largest aquarium, so I don't know if that's a true story. I googled it last night actually, okay, and it real. is the okay. biggest one in the U.S. Okay, that's what I thought, but like I didn't. I didn't so want we're to tell excited. <laughs> we're very excited to go embark we'll on this journey. Fish. Where's Teddy? I don't know the dirty clothes in the back. Yeah, All right. Okay. All right, and we will update you when we get there. Don't forget to sanitize. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, shoot. Coming up right there. We are at the train station in Georgia. Yep. And we're about to get westbound. <laughs> and then we're gonna Don't show you. This I'm the sorry. Then we're gonna show you a surprise. I think our train's coming. I don't want to have the camera out on the train. Just don't, don't say, don't say where we're going out loud because there's cycles around. <laughs> you never know. You never know. Samantha and I are very confused. We don't know how to get to the aquarium, but it's okay because we still have time. I just, like I said though, in previous videos, I feel like we both should look at, be looking at the directions at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> because we just don't pay attention to anything. And we just right. get lost very easily. Right. And I'm so. really bad at directions and I have no idea where I'm at. And then you too. <laughs> <laughs> so we're just figuring out. I do smell food though. And I'm so hungry. But we're going to enjoy this aquarium and we're going to get there. We're going to have a fun time. Okay, it's an 11 minute walk. I don't think so. I think you're in focus. My lips are crusty. <laughs> okay, so overall the aquarium was really cool. Like I keep wanting I keep wanting to call it the shed aquarium, but that's just because of how it is in Chicago. But it's it was actually really big and really cool. It was huge. Yeah. The exhibits and like I don't know. I feel like the dolphin show was the best part. Definitely. I 
cried because <laughs> mixed emotions about the whole training dolphins to be your entertainment, but it was good. <laughs> it was entertaining. <laughs> yeah. And then, oh my God, we were, Sam was getting so hungry. So we were like, okay, let's just go and eat the cafe food inside the aquarium. Yeah. Bad mistake. Very bad. We spent $30 on some, it wasn't chicken. <laughs> <laughs> and some nasty chili cheese fries. The food was so bad. So just, I took like three bites out of my sandwich. And I was like, no, I'm throwing it away. Like, it was disgusting. Definitely like, I would understand if it was $12. 30. <laughs> and apparently the lemonade tasted like cup. So it wasn't even good. <laughs> no, like, it wasn't nothing. even good. Not so bad. Cross. Cross, yeah. So overall it was a good experience except for the food so right now we are going to head back to the marta and then we are going to go home walk the dog do some homework do some homework and then go grocery shopping for food tonight and wine and wine so we will continue vlogging later i'm so out of breath because i'm walking uphill so whatever bye bye <laughs> all right so we just got back from the aquarium and we are so tired. <laughs> our legs hurt so much, our body hurts. We're not used to yeah, walking I mean, around. We literally don't walk. Yeah, anywhere, neither one of us. But now we just took some showers and now we're watching Shield. This is Teddy. This is Teddy. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, we just wanted to update the vlog and let you know that we are so tired and we are ready for bed. I might come back when we're cooking dinner later, but we just wanted to relax and maybe take a nap before we cook dinner and end our night. So, bye. What you doing? <laughs> I'm getting some ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> so I forgot to vlog us making dinner tonight, but we decided to only make mac and cheese, but homemade. So we had the noodles and we had all the cheese. And here, this is what it looks like. Let's try not get it done. Oh, <laughs> nice. So we just used cheddar. Mild Italian. cheddar and Italian cheese with heavy whipping cream. And that's it. I don't know if that's exactly how I'm supposed to make it, but probably not. Probably not. <laughs> but I want to eat a little bit more right now. So I'm going to eat a little bit. It's so good. But. Definitely, I could change some stuff up in the future because I'm like strictly going off of like smell. <laughs> no measurements, no nothing. No measurements. So I was just like, what is this food? What is this thing? So now I know what to do in the future. Yeah. Less butter, We've talked about it, yeah. Flour. And it'll be great. <laughs> it was just like experimenting at that point, but now she's eating ice cream. Mm -hmm. After having so much dairy, mm -hmm. and <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but I can't do that because I am lactose intolerant, and and you need to, but not just not as bad. Yeah, like I will seriously like die if I have too much. Which I'm sure like everybody who's watching this already knows that, so they know what's gonna happen to me. But we decided that we were just going to drink some wine, watch the new Proud Family that's on, while yes. she eats her ice cream, and then wine, we are, are going to... Wine and ice cream. And we are also need to do some homework, because tomorrow's Monday. So, just yeah. wanted to update you guys on that. I think we might call it a night tonight. Yeah. So this is the end of day one, one. in Georgia. I almost said two. <laughs> one. All right, see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night. <laughs>
It's not chocolate like. <laughs> So we didn't vlog all day today. All day. But that's okay because right now we are. And we decided to go out and get some ice creams from... Why is it Butter and on cream. cream. <laughs> Butter and cream in Atlanta, Georgia. Decatur, Georgia. Decatur. Right next to Atlanta. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's kind of, yeah, it's you like, know what? It's, it's pretty hot. Oh, sorry if you yeah. can't hear me. There's old people talking next to me. Hi. <laughs> I know. So much was happening. But now that these old people are finally gone, um, we didn't vlog today. Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> How am I supposed to eat this without making my teeth all cold? <laughs> You're the one who wanted to get a I comb. I love combs. <laughs> so we didn't vlog, but we decided to go get ice cream tonight. And then we are going to walk around her campus. Because I'm getting a tour while I'm on vacation. In the dark. <laughs> In the dark. But it's fine, because the last time I got a tour, it was raining. So it's fine. I feel awkward around all these people. And I also it's literally who cares though. I know. I even told Samantha today that like my first like vlog, I look crusty dusty. So like the next one, I maybe I should do like a get ready with me or something because I do look insane. I don't want like these people in the background to like yell at me for like recording them or something. We're not gonna yell at you, dude. <laughs> a lot of things. Yeah. Okay. So we're just giving a tour. We kind of missed half of it because Jess goes bad. I know. I'm vlogging. literally terrible at vlogging. I literally forgot. And it's not my vlog, so I don't remember. Yeah. <laughs> but Sam's giving me this amazing tour of her school. It's so beautiful, the campus. It literally, like, it's so huge. Like, it's a small school, but campus is still pretty big. But, like, there's, like, seating areas over here, you see? really nice but I bet in daytime too it's even nicer yeah. <laughs> but of course I'm getting the tour at night well. but it's fine and I like it too because everything's so close together I was just telling her like it's everything's like so compacted together it's like walking distance it's like very easy to get to one building to the next what they should have is like connecting things so you can just stay inside. But then again, you guys don't have that bad weather, so it's not like you need that. Yeah. Well, there's like paths over here. I just didn't take you that way because I wanted to go around. I went the wrong way. Oh. Yeah. yeah. There's like connecting inside paths? Yeah, there's inside paths. Ooh, this tree's wild. <laughs> this is still Campbell. <laughs> this building right here is Buttrick. This is where like all of the English, language, all of those classes, um, history, stuff like that. They're all here. It's just like a building for classrooms. There's no labs or anything. Sam was also telling me when we passed the church that people do their weddings here, like on campus, just because the church is so pretty. But also, like, people film here, like movies and TV shows, like Hawkeye was filmed very here. Often. Like very often, she Life says. Life of the Party, if you know that. Um, one of the screens was filmed here. The new one? No, just one of them. Oh. Like an older one. An older one? Um, and then a new show that's going to be coming out in 2023 or 24. I think it's called, like, Tell Me Lies. It's like a drama. I don't know. Um, they're actually filming like right now during this season. So we're not allowed to go to some of our classes the way that we like to. <laughs> Whatever. But that's fine because your like campus gets that. Like, what's the word I'm looking for? Clout. Okay, yeah, clout. <laughs> this is Presser. The, this is like where all of the um, music classes are. They're over so here. Oh my god, can and you see the stars? Wow, look at the stars. What is it called? Was I trying to say? Um, these are where like ceremonies are held. There's like a stage and a bunch of seats and stuff that you go in. 
there, but we're probably not gonna have graduation there just because of code. So where would graduation take place? I'm pretty sure on that big. On that field by that the church? Wow. Nice little gazebo over there. This is the financial aid department. Yes, the oh, gazebo. I've been over here before with cutest, you. Cutest place. This is Rebecca Hall. This is all like residence halls and like stuff like that. People would do. It's the more pricey of the bunch. So for each residence hall, it depends on like how much you want to pay for the nicer hall. Yeah. Wait, what is this right here? This is Butcher. And just look at the architecture. I know, that's what I was just about to say. Like, look how beautiful. It kind of looks like churchy. The style is... Ancient. Something gothic. I feel like I should do that. <laughs> Look how big though, like, so nice. Did it take you long to like navigate everywhere? Like, to be honest, I don't remember like freshman year. I don't either. <laughs> it's fine. I don't remember. I don't. I, mean, I feel like it did take me. Um, a bit to navigate. What about after the pandemic coming back for the first time? Because um, personally for me, like going back to DePaul, I had no idea where any of my classes were. I had to start opening up maps again. Okay. Um, it wasn't like hard to remember where things were. I think I was just winded by all the uphill and downhill. <laughs> like me right now? Yes. I can't breathe. I'm like out of breath walking because everything's like... Yeah, and it's like cobblestone <laughs> too. So I'm like, I'm always tripping. Because <laughs> like the bricks oh, are like not the same height. But yeah. It's cute here. Yeah, you Enjoy see all it. of those lights are off. That's where like the residence um, dorms and stuff would be. So, yeah. Oh, I can see like that window's open over there. Unless there's like no window at all right there. You said it was falling apart? Yeah, like students were complaining that um, things were leaking, walls were cracked, like pipes were busted and stuff like that they so they just had demolished the whole thing yeah so i they're just like creating a whole new residence hall i guess watch it be like the nicest one now it's probably going to be <laughs> and that's why like no shade on agnes i like that i went here they challenged me academically and made me i think into a better person but they like their money. <laughs> As any college does. And so like them doing all these movies and TV shows, you know, like I feel like it's really because they're just trying to make it like a better campus and like better residence halls just to get more students. It's getting more attention. Yeah. Like in our cafeteria or I'm our dining hall, there's literally screens that tell you what's for lunch and dinner now. And inside of Molly's, there's like a screen. Like, oh, there's yeah. a whole They're like putting store. that money towards something. Right. But I mean, like, they have to do something. Like, it's an all girls college. They can't, people like aren't I mean, running to go. Oh, yeah, historically. I guess you could say it's like an all female biological okay. college. Yeah, that makes sense. But, but like, that's what they want, that's what they intend for. Yeah. It's not like they're openly accepting applications for men. So like they have to find some way to get people to come here. Yeah. Honestly, Posse was like smart. They were like, how would you feel about Agnes Scott? And I put Agnes Scott number three on my list. And mm -hmm. I swear I didn't know anything about Agnes Scott. I just put it because it was in Georgia and it was far away. <laughs> and warm so i put it on my list and they were like so like you're okay with it being in all a historically all women's college and i was like yeah <laughs> yeah and then they said why and i just had to make stuff up i was like i think it'll be empowering 
and like <laughs> all this stuff. But then they were like, cool. And then now I'm here. And that was my second interview and I had three interviews. You had three interviews for this place? Mm-hmm. Well, for Posse. Mm -hmm. To get accepted. Yeah. Well, I think we're gonna close this out right now. Hey. And we'll you talk to you guys not, later. You better not bark. stuff to do tomorrow, so I can't stay. In South Carolina, so we should have just like had Jessica like come yeah, yeah. To South Carolina. Have, have like my own like, little hotel room. Yeah. We didn't think about that. <laughs> we didn't think. No, nope, but you know what? It's fine. It's my spring break, so once I get home, I'm gonna finish writing this paper. That should have been turned in a long time ago, but now it's fine. Um, and then I can work on handing job applications. Because <laughs> that's the main goal. Spring yeah. break, break, fun. This was like my little adventure. We did have an adventure. I think my favorite part is you see that car? I'm sorry. That car, he just like crosses in front of like other cars so late. Yes. But I think my favorite part was the aquarium. I think that was a nice thing to do. Yeah, it was fun. Except for the food, of course. Yeah, but it was, <laughs> it was a fun uh, time. Our body was ready to work out a little bit and we got to enjoy some Yeah, I have never to buy cafeteria from the aquarium. <laughs> that was disgusting. I mean, we have blisters on our feet from walking so much. My body hurts from walking up and down hill. But you know what? That's fine. And I won't see Sam again until May. Until I'm a graduate. A college graduate? That's so exciting. And then once she comes home, it's my turn. Yep. So, we're doing this. But she's dropping me off at the airport now. So, I guess we're going to end this vlog here. Next video, you'll see me soon.